Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be sh filming a Macy's haul. Um, so my mom and I went shopping late at night after I had gotten off of work and you know when you're really tired and all your self control just kind of goes away. That is definitely what this, uh, what happened this evening. So if you'd like to see what I got, just keep watching. So we actually went to two different Macy's. Um, we went to the one because it was they were doing the one day sale and I wanted two items and the one store didn't have it so we drove all the way across the metro area to another Macy's to get the item because it was such a good deal. Um, and that was the My very Hollywood Michael Kors perfume and it was the one day sale was on sale for 30 instead of 65 so it was quite a big difference which made driving in the icy drizzle worth it plus I found an insane amount of stuff at the second store so this is what it looks like it's so pretty it's very pink it has very Hollywood on the top and it smells really nice so I wanted another perfume for my collection, so that's what I got. And then when I was there, they had a lot more at this store than at the other one. So I picked up some fun things. I picked up the Urban Decay Naked Trio Illuminators, because this was actually on sale. Um, if I can get it open. There you go. So these were actually, they're um, on sale now, so that's why I decided to pick it up because I thought it was kind of pretty, but you know, I wasn't sure how much I would use it, but once it went down to 21, I thought, eh, that's a pretty good deal. I'm excited to try it. Um, so that was exciting. They also had, and I almost squealed in the store because they still had them, and they ended up ringing up half price, so they were $9, and they were the Alice in Wonderland lipsticks. They had three of them, so I bought all three that they had left. This first one is a Rasabeth, and oh, it got smushed. Somebody turned it, but that's okay. I will still use it and still love it. And this is the red color, um, and then the other ones that they had were both Alice, which is such a lovely neutral shade with that pink shift that it really like I figure I will use this a lot and it was worth getting both of them because they were both for the same price can you see that on my hand my lights are doing crazy things today so I was really excited that they had those still um, I got all of them that they had left and was so happy as I was leaving the store. But not just because of that, but because of the other things they had on sale as well. So they had a lot of MAC things from the Nutcracker Suite set that were also um, on sale for the one day sale or probably because they're trying to liquidate things because it's getting closer to Christmas. And I'd really wanted so much, I mean, if I'm honest, I would have bought everything from the Mac Nutcracker collection because it's so pretty and the packaging is so pretty. So this is the Nutcracker Sweet Nudes lipstick set. Let's see if I can get one out to show you what colors they are. Okay, that was an ordeal. It literally took me several minutes to get just one of them out. I don't want to break the packaging, but um, they're really hard to get out of the packaging because of how they're in there. Um, so this is the first color, and this is in the color, it does not say, but it's very pretty. I wonder if it says on the back of the container. No, nope, it just says Nude Sweets. So um, I will try to get the rest of these out, and I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I finally got them all out, and I'm going to set them up here for a second, pull them all out. They're all pretty, they're kind of similar, but they're all just really nice everyday shades that you can wear basically anytime, anywhere. So the f this is the first one, and I will swatch it as well. And then the second one. Ooh, I like that one. And then we have the third one, which is the pinkest of the group. And I have the only MAC lipstick I've tried is the one for, that was in the retro red set that was the Macy's exclusive. So I'm excited to try these. 
they're all really nice. Um, you can see them all. I'm excited. The two in the middle are definitely my favorites, and I see myself wearing those a lot more than the other ones. But I think they're all nice, and for the price when they went on sale, I think it was worth it. But I'm not going to put them back in their little box because I don't think I'll ever get them back out. But I love the little box. I think if I can get the plastic out of it, that'll be a nice little uh, trinket box. So the next thing that I got was also another of these sets. And they have the little, I forgot to show on the other one. It has the same thing. It has the little gold pull tab on it. And then this is the pink patent polish kit. So there's four lipsticks in this set. And you can actually see them. Um, I'll do a swatch of this purple one. Oh, that's so much fun. Um, so they're a little bit, you can see the colors down here at the bottom. They're a little bit um, more, not neutral, but they're still, I think you could wear them a lot. They're not like bright, weird colors. And that's what that one looks like. Give a little shade there. So yeah, those I think are very nice. Um, I'm excited to try those as well. Um, I've been a little crazy this year with makeup, uh, but I haven't gotten a lot of makeup for the past couple years because I've been focusing more on skincare. So this year I went a little crazy. Um, and then the next thing I got from MAC, the last thing I got from MAC actually, is one of the palettes. And this is the Sweet cool eye compact take out the it has a little brush with it and then it has all of these beautiful colors pinks and green or not greens but grays and nice neutral colors so I'm super excited to try this I think it's beautiful this was my favorite of the compact so when they had it on sale I was very very happy and then the last thing that I got at this Macy's, I was shocked that they had because it was released like two days ago and it was only supposed to be available online, but they had it on the shelf. So I picked up the Sweet Peach by Too Faced palette and I used this yesterday and I also used it today. And that's, that's what I have on my eyes. It's all from the Sweet Peach. It's so pretty. And it does smell like peaches. And those are all the colors. I don't want to blind you. But, oh, so many pretty colors. I really am liking it so far. I'm going to be doing a review on it. Um, so watch for that. Or you might actually have seen the review already. I might do that, the, that video first because people haven't gotten it from their orders yet. So I was really excited about getting this one. All right, so the first Macy's we went to, um, I actually went um, not only for the Michael Kors, but I also really liked this mini perfume set that they had, but it was $50. Can you imagine paying $50 for the little tiny perfume bottles? But they were $25, half price, so I got them. It comes with a Michael Kors Sexy Amber, um, then you have the Senor... Signorina Mysterioso Eau de Perfume from Formaggio, then My Burberry Black Parfum, and then Dahlia Divine Le Nectar um, Perfume, and that's Givenchy or Givenchy, um, and then the Mogler Alien, and then Jimmy Choo Signature. So lots of different scents teeny tiny bottles which I think are so cute and I love getting so that was one of the two things that I had gone to get but then I of course ended up with other things uh, they had a couple of deals going on with Lancome and the one was this set which I am attempting to get out of the box right now and it was I think it was a purchase with a purchase so if you spent if you bought anything from Lancome you could get it and it comes woo, it comes in this pretty bag nice pink it's um, that kind of metallic faux leather that's been really popular I've seen lots of things and then inside it are several items the first thing in here is a brush 
if I can get it open. Let's see. I have scissors. We'll cut it open. Um, so it's a nice blush brush. Very nice and soft. I haven't tried any Lancome brushes, so that will be interesting to try. And then there's tissue paper. And then things wrapped in tissue paper. This is the first thing. This is a Blush Subtle Palace in Nectar Lace. And it actually is a contour, a hot light, and a blush. And it's very light colored. So if you have um, a lighter skin tone, I think it will be just beautiful. Um, because it won't be too overpowering for your skin tone. Then we have, let's see what's in this one. Oh, uh, one of the Lancome Hypnos Drama Mascaras. And also, what is this? This is, it's a, I think it's a lipstick. A lip crayon. I'm going to double check on the box though. It's a nice neutral color. So this is what everything, when you get it all together, I don't know if you can see that or if it's blinding. That's what comes in it. This is... Catholic Church in the middle. So this is what it looks like, if I don't blind you. Um, this, it has four full-size products in it. This is actually a lip crayon. Um, and that's the color of the lip crayon. It's very nice. It's a nice neutral shade. And then, um, of course, you get the cosmetics case. And then it has two eyeshadows. And, oh. So they lift up like this to open. And this is the color Mannequin. And then this color is filigree and they're both shimmer shades but they're very pretty I like them a lot so nice neutral like everyday look that you can use with this set and then with that I also got they had a free gift the day of and it has this very sparkly cosmetics bag and then it looks like I get actually grab those scissors again another brush from Lancome. It looks to be the same, so I'm not going to open it because I don't need to open two of the same brush uh, to try them out. And then, oh, that's just paper telling me what I got. And then there's another, this is a different mascara. This is def, Definitials. And then a, um, this is this a micellar? Oh, this is an eye makeup remover. So an eye makeup remover. And then a little palette of blush. A very pretty shade. Cover that up. Very nice pretty shade. And then a lip gloss in Cinema Cinnamon. We'll swatch this one. Oh, it's, it's very pretty. I actually think if you layered that on top, of the other one that would be just really pretty so that all came together but I hadn't spent quite enough to get the free gift and obviously I had to buy something to get the gift with the purchase with purchase so I went over to their blushes and I got um, their highlighter shade and it's very pretty I think so it's a very pale um, shimmery color can't really see it on my skin with on the camera but I'm excited to try that and I felt like that was something that I would actually use a lot um, and then I could get all of the free things and the discounted things with it all right and the last thing we got at Macy's I know bought so much stuff at Macy's um, was a kit that my mom saw and thought was amazing and she wanted me to she wanted to get it for me so that I could come on here and review it for you all. Um, but with that, sh she bought the Elizabeth Arden Red Door Perfume. It's just a nice little set, so that's for her. But she wanted, she got that so that she could get this other purchase with purchase. And this is the Bright Lights Big City Collection 
from Elizabeth Arden. Lots and lots of stuff in there. Um, so I'm going to unbox it now and see what's all that came in it and show you guys. And then I will do a more in-depth review um, later on. So in here, oh, it is a pretty nice makeup case, actually. Um, pretty sturdy. We'll see if that's just cardboard on the inside. It does have lots of cardboard inside, so that's what it looks like when you open it. Take out all of that. And it comes with four lipsticks. And then what else is in here? Um, this is a eye and lip makeup remover. So that's interesting that they have a lip remover as well. So it's one of those ones you have to shake up because they're separated. So that's the first thing that fell out. And then what else do we have in here? So we have some palettes. So the first palette in here is more dark uh, brownie shades. So I drop it, but I didn't break it, thank goodness. And then we also have a more of the cooler shades, the pinks and plums and greens. That's very pretty. I like that one. I always gravitate more towards the pinks and the purples than anything else. And then we have, ooh, this is a nice little palette. So there's two blushes and a highlighter. Very, very nice. Okay, and then we also get four are these all eyeliners or are they lips? Oh, two of them are lip. Oh, great. I've been wanting to get some new lip um, pencils or lip liners. So we have two eyeliners. I'll open those first. These are in Java and Blackberry. So one that goes with each palette. One's kind of a purpley. The other is a brownish color. And then you have the two lip liners which come in bare and natural. Very nice. Um, I did not bring, or I need to get a new, I broke my little sharpener because I never get pencils anymore. So I'm gonna have to get a new sharpener for those. And then you get three brushes, um, two eye brushes. So this is an angled brush and then you have just like a tapered brush. So those are nice, um, very useful with everything else that you need. So this basically like has everything you need for a couple different looks. And then this is the blush brush or the face brush. Very soft, reminds me a lot of the same material as the Lancome brush that I just looked at. And then you have a mascara. This is the Grand Entrance Mascara. And then two glosses. Um, and I was going to open them, but I'm not going to open them yet. So you have a purple and a gold. Those would be really nice to go over lip colors. And then let's see, what are the four lipsticks that we get? So much packaging. So the colors are iced, grape, pink, Pucker, bold red and barely there so let's start with barely there that's pretty very nice oh, I won't leave that in the camera's eye and then this is the red this is the bold red then we have this is pink pout no pink pink pucker so it's kind of similar they're pretty similar in shades the Barely there and the pink pucker and then we have the final thing in here is the iced grape so there's actually like if I sh after it's all unwrapped like there's quite a bit of stuff that came in this set so um, I think it's interesting 
thanks to my mom for getting it and I will look forward to swatching and reviewing everything for you all. Um, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. It would mean so much to me uh, to get more subscribers and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.